Hey, everybody, Ann here, and this, I've got my happy face on because there is nothing better than sitting here in front of my rocket stove, cooking a pot of beans and ham with my girl right by me. She can reach all the way over here, and we just been chilling out together. I've been texting back and forth with a friend, and I'm going to add some more some more wood to that in a little bit, but I'm in no hurry because the coals are just very, very hot. And, uh, well, I watered all my plants. I've been turning the solar panels. And I'm just looking out here at my property that is getting green, green, green. But it is also getting very, very unruly. I need to figure this out because I tell you what, some of this brush is coming up to my knees. Mmm, ham, beans, and dandelion greens. This is going to be delicious. After I take the big pieces of fat and bone out of it, I can't wait. I think this is just about done. What do you think? Let me take a little taste. Get the dandelion greens in there and a few beans. Let's taste this. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mmm. Delicious. This pot is a mess, but. Mmm, I don't care. Oh, that's going to be so good. I mean, it is good. All right. Let me stop this, and I'm just going to go eat. I did eat it, and it was delicious. Basically, it's just navy beans I had soaked overnight, some ham that had some bones and fat in it, salt, pepper, I think some brown sugar, paprika, maybe some chili powder, and the dandelion greens, and it was great. But that is not what the nature of this video is about. This video is going to be about rude, empty people on my channel and what I will and will not allow. Here we go. This first one came on the Facebook page, basically on the first day that I put it up. Need to clean up your place more and depend on yourself, your parents always helping you as old as they are. You're kind of a lazy woman. Well, guess who's no longer welcome on the Facebook page? I suspect that this is probably somebody who I won't allow to comment on my YouTube channel so they thought that they could access me on Facebook. But you know what? No more. You're gone. This next one comes from Paul Robertson on one of my videos on YouTube. Got it just this morning. Can anybody tell me the background of this lady's life, please? I don't know. Just got that funny tummy feeling. Oh, yeah, Mr. Paul Robertson, who probably just made his account today to just leave me that one message. I've got a response for you, and I have pinned your comment to set you as an example for what's going to happen. If you wanted to get to know me, all you need to do is ask me. I suspect I'll get many more commenters like you coming in and casting doubt upon my credibility. If you want to get to know me, just watch my videos. Go back from the start. I'm not a victim of anything. I'm not saying I have cancer or, or am helpless and e-begging people for money or gifts. I ask for nothing from anyone. I simply want a very calm, peaceful, simple, minimalistic life. That's what I've got. I'm not sorry if I've offended you. If you think for one second that I will allow you or anyone else to come and do this whole titter-tatter gossip thing on this channel, trying to pit commenters or subscribers against the owner of this channel, which is myself or anyone else, you will be gone in one hot minute. This is a positive, supportive, warm, and kind space. I've seen your kind on the internet since people were allowed to participate in it. People like you come in and try and cozy up to people, then divide and conquer. It ain't gonna happen here. So if you think that's what your goal is, you can just mosey along right now. And this is the last time I'm going to address this kind of situation. I won't bring attention to these commenters because really what they want is the attention that I'm giving them right now. They want to feel as though they've upset me or they've gotten a rise out of me. Well, it's not going to happen anymore. You're just going to disappear and you're never going to be seen again by anybody on my channel. And you know what? This isn't my first rodeo. I know how things work. And I know that there are a lot of empty, black-hearted people out there. 
You know, there was a situation similar to this that happened to me a few years ago. Someone came on, uh, I had a website, I can't remember what it was, but um, somebody came on and was starting to start strife amongst the community members and uh, said a lot of hurtful, awful things to me and about me. And it, I was just really confused. I couldn't understand. Well, my confusion only increased when I found out who it was. And it was actually somebody I knew, somebody who I thought was a friend. And that confused me even more. I couldn't wrap my head around why somebody would be like that to somebody who they had treated like a friend. Well, I don't know. I, I, I don't try and figure these things out anymore because I just know that there are people out there who are just ugly, mean, jealous, you know, especially when they see other people being happy, when they see um, a community of people rallying around a certain person. There's going to be a few people out there who are jealous. They may be in the same kind of YouTube community that I'm posting videos in. Um, they may be people I know who have been friends, either from Ohio, heck, maybe even here. I don't know. All I know is it's not going to happen. I'm going to keep doing what I'm doing because I enjoy making these videos about the things that I do so that I can go back and look at them someday and point and laugh at myself or just remember the accomplishments or the cool things that I did. So I'm going to keep going just as I am. And I imagine that you will probably keep going, you ugly, empty, mean-spirited people, with what you're doing. And I will be feeling happiness, and you will continue to try and fill your emptiness with your malice and viciousness. But it's not going to happen on my channel. So, this is the last time any of you are going to be addressed. And I will not trouble anybody else who watches this channel with your pettiness. And you know what? All I ask for on this channel is that we be good to one another and be genuine, true friends, not the kind of friend that, well, you know, the ones that subscribe to the, the saying of keep your friends close and your enemies closer. Yeah, that's another thing I can never wrap my head around is why people would want to keep their enemies closer. I don't get it. You know, me, I will put my, my enemies at a, as far a distance as possible. You know, when you have a friend who ha who says that, keep your friends close, but your enemy's closer, how do you know if you're the friend or the enemy? If they're keeping you close to them, you never know. You just never know. So be kind, be genuine, and, well, just enjoy your life and don't try and destroy other people's. Anyhow, that's all I got for you guys today. See you in the next video. Thanks for watching, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.